Welcome back everyone, Emily Goldblum taking you through a Maison Goldblum stretch class. Uh, if I were with you in person, I'd of course be asking you how are you all feeling today. So I hope everyone's feeling good and I hope you're feeling ready and strong in here because this is more than half the battle. Um, today's class, you won't need much. I have my mat just for a little bit of cushion in the beginning when we're going to be doing some cardio. And then I have my ankle weights, which I'll be using two pound ball of angles for um, on the floor work. So we'll start up, start standing up, and then we're gonna end up on the floor for the full um, second half of class. Uh, so yeah, if, um, I don't know, if you guys have these parts in class where like things just get really too hard and you wanna give up, try to think of a visualization, a place something that brings a smile to your face that you can go to when you get to that point, just so that you can try and push through um, for, your, for yourself, just to see how that feels for you. All right, so I'm gonna put the music on and let's get started. Okay, so we're just gonna start with a light jog, back and forth. Five, 
One, two, good. Side to side. Left, right. Left, right. Left. Good. All right. We're gonna come into a nice deep squat here. Open those toes. Take them out. Side. The hips facing forward. Lift those kneecaps up. Take a deep breath. Arms up. Lower the hips. Good. And up. Twist to your right. Up. Down. Up. Twist to your left. Breathe. Down. Up. Twist. Up. Good. We're here for 20 seconds. Arms down. Lift up. Twist. Open that upper back. Grab hold of those hips. Then give yourself a little extra twist for a deeper stretch. Opening up that low back. Reach up, all around, hug and pull. Up, around, hug those hips, pull. Good. Ten more. Lower, up. Really opening up those hips. Up. Yes. Squeeze those glutes. I love it. Mm. 
when when I get sweaty. And I don't have like, you know, a heated room, hot yoga, or anything like that. It's just like all us, it's all the power of your body and the movement that you're doing, these fluid movements, helping you open up and gain some strength. All right, so I want you to start on your right side and wait, no, we're gonna start with the abs first. Pardon me. <laughs> so you're gonna come and you're gonna bring your right leg straight, left leg bend. We're just here, up. So bend, straight, bend, straight. Scissor kick, kicks, half leg scissor kicks. One leg bent and your right leg is straight. Working that right leg, driving it in to your chest. Good. Hop. Bringing those shoulder blades off the floor, reaching up towards your knee and shin bone. Good. Up, up, yes, good. Pull it in, in. Press that needle down into the mat. Lovely. Now hold, you can hold the back of your knee or your calf, your right leg. Pull it in, breathe. Anchor that hip down. Don't let it get hiked up here. Take it down, good. For a deeper stretch. And flex. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Good. And point. Nice. Now we're taking it down. Coming onto your side. Onto your left side. <laughs> and we're gonna work on that right leg. So you're up on your forearm here. Trying to extend the side body that's closest to the floor, and you're gonna extend lower. Straight, all the way. Nice and fluid. Steady movement. Find your pace. Point that toe. Try to keep that leg behind your elbow in line with your shoulder. Beautiful. And really extend and straighten that supported leg. Lift up from that side body. Good. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Three. Two. One. Now from here, you're going to come. You're going to bend that knee in a 90 degree angle. And you're gonna lower it to the floor. So your hip bones come facing the floor. You're pressing into the, the floor to lift up. And we're lifting. Good. Down and side. 90 degree bend. Really working those obliques in that core. Pressing away from the floor. All five fingers spread apart. Breathe. Lower. Lift. Opening up that hip. Those hips working on those muscles. Stretch and strengthen. Stretch it here. Lift it. Good. Five. Pulling in. Four. Three. Two. Good. Good. One. You're going to take it back. I'm going to move it in front. Take that leg back. Rotate that hip back. Point and straighten. So bend, point the toe into the mat and straighten. Good. We're here for 20. Really press that chest. Puff it up forward, stretching that upper back. Good. Bend and extend and squeeze with everything you got. Squeeze. Good. And breathe. Open up. Extending that hip flexor back behind you. Bottom leg is fully engaged. Pointed toes, kneecap lifted. Press. Good. Back. Tap and lift. Tap, lift. Good. Five, four, three, 
sec, loop two, reach it out, 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 one. Good, you're gonna come down, take your left arm behind you, somewhat in a V, and then just rotate that shoulder to the floor, just for an extra opening of that upper back. Good, you can take that knee back for more of a deeper stretch here. You don't need to, but this is an option. Breathe. Like 
nice and straight, or you can keep it in a bend. And we're just gonna take little mini lifting of the chest. Stretch. After that nice hard work, you deserve to stretch. Lower and lift. Elongate the spine, take it out of your low back. Breathe, lower. And you can stay here with a bent, with a straight leg if you want. Good, up, lower. That's it. All right, come down. Place your hand, forearm in front of you to lift that knee up. Good, now you're coming onto your back. We're gonna work on a little bit of abs, flutter kicks here, and then we're going on to the other side. All right, stay with me. So you can have your hands either behind your head, up behind your head, but straight, or by your side, however you feel most comfortable. And we're gonna flutter. So legs crossing, press that belly down, up. Breathe, 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 and criss, cross those legs. Cross and point. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Press that belly down. Good. And 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take it up. Scissor kick here. Scissor kick or flutter kick. <laughs> Shell small, fit position. <laughs> so many different ways to identify and categorize all of these movements. Open up that chest. Good. Press it in, 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 in. Squeeze those inner thighs. Turn those hips out. Good. Take it down. Slow squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Those ankles hold 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, hug it in. Roll. Give your little low back a little massage here. Roll those knees, hips in a circle. Beautiful. All right. Now we're going to go on to the other side. So we're going to repeat that whole sequence. Coming on to your, coming on to your right side. And we're going to just start with those kicks, side kicks. And you're up on your forearm. And you're going to start with a bent knee to straight. Lift it straight. Feel that stretch. Feel where you want to keep that body pressing up. Lower. Good. Tap the heel and lift. Breathe. Press that chest forward and up towards the sky. Good. Squeeze. Turn that hip out. Lower with control. Breathe. Up, up, up. Yes. Squeeze. Beautiful blue sky here today in California. Although, I really wish we could have some rain. Squeeze, lift those kneecaps. Extending that leg, fully engaged. Quad, squeeze those inner thighs. And 10 more, 10, nine, eight, lift up. See, we get tired. And then forget, come on, six, five, pull that navel in, lift, four, three, two, one, beautiful. From here, bend that knee, 90 degree bend, hand onto the floor, bend it, and the elbow to lift, woo, a little too much. I always start off really strong. <laughs> and up and lower. Pressing in those low abdominal, that low abdominal wall. Lift. Lower. Lift. Good, good. Up. Nice and steady. Breathe. 
lift and lower. Up, down, squeeze, up, squeeze, and lift. Really working that outer thigh. Good. And five more. Five.
spine. Good. Lift. Lift. Squeeze. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right. You're taking it down onto your belly, bringing that knee in that position that we were in. So half froggy, hike up that knee towards your waistline, and then chest facing the floor. You come down low, and you're lifting that back leg straight. Lift it for a half Superman, half froggy position. Lift, extend, and squeeze. Elongate that spine, reach that neck out, relax. Breathe through any discomfort, unless it's a pinching, then just readjust and find a comfortable position. Put a pillow underneath those hips for some height, put two pillows if you need, and lift, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Now you're going to bend, open the knee, and then bend and extend. Do you notice how my ankle isn't coming all the way down to the floor? That's okay. Nor does yours need to. If it does, that's great. But this is just working on that mobility, opening up those hips. Creating some range of motion. Bend, open, bend, extend. Yes. I'll take it up the floor. Knee off the floor. Bend and lower. Open that hip. Back to neutral and bend. Open, bend, extend. Bend, open, bend, extend. Beautiful work. Come on. Lower. Yes, and lower. Lift, extend, and squeeze. Breathe. Lift and extend. Lower, lower, lower. That knee as you turn it up. Back to turning it in. Neutral. Out. Bend it and straight. Good. Now you can either stay in this leg straight position and lift up. Creating some length. Now we're just going to lower and lift. So you're either here or if you want that added opening of the hip, stretch and come here. Lower that chest and extend it up. Lower and up. You're sort of in a twisted position here. Creating length in that right side body here. You can reach whatever you need. Just play with it. Good. Send that leg out. Come onto your elbow. Press that palm in. Lift. Good. Now we're going to come into what we started with our half scissor kicks. So you're gonna bend, you're bending in your left leg. I apologize. And you're, you're gonna come in straight, your straight leg is gonna be your right leg and then bend it in like that. So that we're in the opposite motion that we did when we started it off. So right leg should be coming up. And then straight, then straight. Lift your shoulder blades off the mat. Up, bend, reach, shin. Your shin comes in and turns your body. Lift up. Yes. 
down. And stretch, bend, reflex. And point, flex and pull. Point, release. Flex it as you pull it in. Release and point. Good, flex. Good, now switch legs. Flex, pull it in, anchor that hip down so it's in line with your opposite hip, and then point, release. Flex it in, for a nice deep stretch here. Point and release. Breathe and flex and pull it in. Good, release, breathe. Bend the knees and straighten. 
bend and elongate, elongate from that spine, lift, 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 lift. Good. All right, you ladies and gents and boys and girls, I hope you had a great class and I hope you'll join me for more. And that's it for today. I will see you all very, very soon.